YouTube, you done goofed. This is far too important to use my normal 50s laid back music with. We need something else. Let's have a look. Aha. This will do. So, a few days ago Mr. Repzion got about a quarter of his videos demonetized for being non-advertiser friendly. People were worried but, due to the politically incorrect nature of Repzion's videos, no one panicked. Now, more and more YouTubers are getting videos demonetized for the same reasons. Review Tech USA and even YouTubers with literal millions of subscribers like Philip DeFranco. Not long after, the reasons for this became public. Are you ready? It's quite literally retarded. Let's break this down. Rule number one, if it's at all sexual, even just sexual humor, you cannot make any money. Rule number two, if there is any violence in your video, likely in losing that depicted in video games, you cannot make any money. Rule number three. If your video has any naughty words, such as fuck you YouTube you fucking cunts, you cannot make any money. Rule number four. And this is the only one that makes any sense. You cannot promote drugs in your videos. If you do, you will not make any money. And now for the most fucking retarded rule of all. Rule number five. If you discuss anything that may trigger someone, you cannot make any money. Oh my fucking god. Do YouTube not understand what made them so popular in the first place? On YouTube, you could speak your mind, say what you thought, and you wouldn't be shot in the back. It was one of the only ways to broadcast your opinion to millions of people without getting shot in the back. Now, YouTube seemed to be destroying that exchanging intellectual, but offensive content for dumb, but inoffensive content. Luckily, I do not monetize my videos, so this does not affect me. However, almost all of the larger YouTubers to YouTube for a career. Certain YouTubers like Leafy is here literally abandoned their chances of getting any other job for YouTube, dropping out of college. What are these people going to do? Become literally homeless? This is an important time for YouTube. Do you want to become BuzzFeed, YouTube? A safe space for people who will use the word triggered non-ironically? Or do you want to stay YouTube, a beacon of light in an otherwise offended world? It's up to you now, 